In this video, I will demonstrate how to use an anatomy module found on the website headneckbrainspine.com. This is the brain MRI module. Its interface is similar to others. There are three image sets, axials, sagittals, and coronals. These can be navigated by using the mouse wheel button, as shown here, or by using the arrow keys, the left and right arrow keys found on the keyboard. Alternatively, you can navigate the images by holding down the left mouse button and moving it around an image. And you'll see that the other image planes then become active and they move at the intersection point of the cursor. You can see here that structures are turned on when the mouse moves over them and they're turned off when the mouse moves off of them. For example, this is the caudate nucleus head. While the mouse hovers over it, it uh, becomes active. Now when you click the mouse on a highlighted structure, it synchronizes the other images so that it appears on them as well. So we clicked it and we can see that we can now see where it is in the axial image as well as the coronal from the satchel. By double clicking the structure, it turns that structure highlight on so when you move off of it, it stays on so that you can scroll the adjacent images and see its full extent. You can turn it off by double clicking it as well. Structures can be turned on selectively by the drop-down menu. For example, we'll go to the caudate nucleus head, as we've shown before. You click that on the drop-down menu, and it stays on. You can turn it off by double-clicking it, or by going to the top and selecting All Off. Now, you can learn group structures here in all caps, as well as you can turn on all the structures at once and navigate them and see them that way. Next, I'm going to demonstrate how to use the quiz mode. By clicking the quiz mode button, it takes you to the quiz mode. And structure highlights are turned off on the images. You click the quiz structure. A random structure appears in its highlighted form. And this is the first quiz structure. It's the base of the brain. In the cella tersica, this is the pituitary gland. Check your answer by clicking the check answer button on the menu bar. And the readout is pituitary gland. If you got that correct, you give yourself a thumbs up which we do, and we score ourselves one for one, 100%. Click the quiz structure button again, and another random structure appears. This time it looks like we're looking at a basal cistern that's surrounding the midbrain. I would call this the perimesencephalic or ambient cistern. We check our answer at the top by clicking the check answer button. It's calling it the perimesencephalic cistern. We're right, give ourselves a thumbs up, and we're scoring two for two. You can go back to the learning mode by checking the quiz button, the quiz mode button again and the structures then become active as they were before. Clicking it, uh, the quiz mode again takes you back to your quiz where you were before. Last of all, the help button is just by clicking it, a text field comes up and a description of, of how to use the module appears. Hopefully this answers your questions on how to use an anatomy module found on the website headneckbrainspine.com. Thank you.